Welcome back to Metroid Prime 2. If you could like, comment, and or subscribe, I'd appreciate it. Anything you can do for the channel helps me put more back into the channel for you. All that being said, let's do this. By the way, the, the dark planet hurts. Despite the fact I'm in a spacesuit and have actually in the past traversed space in the spacesuit. I don't know, maybe the atmosphere is made out of acid or something. I don't think I actually want to go this way. Maybe I do? I don't remember. What's the worst that could happen? It's not like I haven't saved or anything. Oh, right. Save room. You never would guess what to do, but you, you dodge the ball of death that the, the things throw at you. I made it to the save room. Hip hip hooray. You know, I got laser. Because somehow that replenishes my health. I guess I should just be glad that I get my health replenished. Oh, I don't remember where exactly I'm supposed to go. Now if I keep roaming in some random direction, I'm eventually going to get my double jump back. And I really want that back. I also need to reset my timer so I know how long I'm recording for. That phasmophobia timer comes in pretty handy. Scream at me all you want, dude. I don't even think I need to fight you. Okay. Ow! Dick. Alright. I need to fight you for reasons? At least your aim is better than everybody else's, apparently. By the way, why do they open up portals to the light dimension to hurt me? Ho ho! I thought you were dead. This is why we need missiles. And that's why. We, oh, it's a dark door. Anyway, I should have just kept walking. I'm on little light crystal creature. Yeah, I'm too patient for that. Anyway, he's getting scared. Nope. Get in here. Both shots missed. Damn. Okay, I don't. I'm not allowed to have missiles. Why is this so hit and miss with that? Can you give me a missile, giant blade of grass. Thank you. I hope I'm going the right way. Pretty sure I am. Yeah, I think memory's starting to come back. Okay, it'd be nice if I could get up that anytime soon. Thank you. Now look, I faced the right correct direction this time. So, give me the health orbs. I'm gonna go get my uh, double jump now. Pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty sure the dude who's got it is like right up there. Or is he right up there? No, he's right up there. You can see how my shots kind of hit nothing. We'll find out for sure when we start the battle. Kind of learned this one from uh, speedrunners and. People doing stuff out of sequence. Yeah, let's see if we uh, start to battle and this dude has less health. Because that'd be hilarious if I could just shoot him from there. That does not help double jump works, buddy. But you do you. How much health are you starting to battle with? Haha, ha, I did hit him a few times. Ah. 
I wish Double Jump made you invincible, but, you know, it is what it is. Your last buddy who tried to just shoot me died pretty quickly. Dying or doing the exact same thing while jumping isn't likely to get you any further along. Oh, made me just miss that. Waste a missile. Oh, he got me. You were one shot, buddy. Just die. Give me my double jump. I want my boots back. Do you have any idea how much those high heels cost? I will curb stomp your face with them. Actually, I'm going to curb stomp your entire species face with them, but. And this planet. Yum, 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 yum. Ooh, look at my. Look at my cows. Super cows. Schmack. Yeah. Now them's boots. These boots were made for jumping. Did that door open for a specific reason? I think I want to go... No, that just take me back the other way, right? That'll take me to the temple, but there's no reason for me to go there yet. So, yeah, I guess I go back to the portal and do stuff. Thank you, light creature. Oh, come on. Turn into a thing, damn it. You die in one way or another. You could at least be useful when you do it. waiting for me this time. Tired of wasting all of the troops on failed ambushes. I feel like that answer is almost definitely yes. But, you know. Chevron 7. Something looked wrong in that portal there, Carter. I will probably continue to make uh, Stargate references as I use portals to travel between worlds. For obvious reasons. Apparently swatted a mosquito that's still in my room. Wow, you do things in the dark world and it affects the light world. Okay, really with this again? Imagine what's going to happen when I get better weapons. Then what are you going to do? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Hmm? Huh? What are you going to do? Okay, I'm done antagonizing the dead people. Okay, I'm not, but... He's just disappeared on me, so there's not much I can do about it. Double jump. Honestly, these things that interface with technology is kind of dumb. I imagine it might have been a bit redundant to constantly use the scan visor for everything, but having to morph and unmorph just to do one bomb. Two bombs, actually. You could use one bomb to jump up. It's a bit much. Ooh, got some buggers. I'm gonna laser myself in the face now.
Oh, I guess until I have other commentary. In case anybody's ever curious about the project car. Ooh, you can actually see the uh, health in there. I want that, but we got a while before we get that. In case anybody's actually curious about the project car, is what I was saying. Um, I didn't need to go that way, did I? No, I'm just walking in circles now, like an idiot. And forgetting where I was talking about. So, all right, uh, the thing turns over. That's about it so far. For some reason, it seems like fuel was not getting delivered into the uh, engine. And pretty sure it's the crank sensor having conniption fits, basically. Because Spark was activating, so it's kind of weird. More or less just like the uh, timing was off, which in a rotary is peculiar because there's not really any timing. And uh, what was the other thing? All right, I can do this now. Um, basically, it's acting like there's just no fuel getting there, which pulled off the fuel rail, turned the key to prime day pump and fuel came shooting straight up and almost into my eyeball so that wasn't the issue <laughs> but uh my train of thoughts all over the place my brain is still warming up today and it's like 6 30 p.m um so i'm pretty sure it's the crank position sensor i don't think it's actually called the crank position sensor on that engine but that's what i'm going to call it for all intents and purposes Okay, I almost prefer the wasps. Anyway. So, I got a new one. Tried to pull out the old one. Half of it... Oh, Jesus. Half of it broke off in the uh, engine. So, now I got to jack that thing up. I'm going to scan that. Look that thing out probably with a bolt extractor. It's my best bet. Heard some people have similar issues when removing that sensor and... Uh, it could be a nightmare because you basically got to pull off the front half of the engine. I'm also pretty sure I got it to backfire pretty bad, so it might have just destroyed all the work I did rebuilding that poor car. I also managed to find some uh, Jetta TDI <laughs> turbo diesel, basically. Um, engines. And I was like, you know, it's only got like 100 horsepower, but it's got like 160 foot pounds of torque, which is, I think, more torque than the. Uh, Mazda gets as it is. Might be worth it to try it. Might. Either that or my brother has to try it in a couple of times to uh, convince me to LS swap it. Dude, I am point blank. How are you missing me? It's not like your shots are doing anything, but still, how? Well, look, distractions for the guys who are about to go and fire up the cannons. Oh, you want to dodge? Wow. Now, these things actually do hurt. if they could hit me with them. So yeah, that's right with the project car. Now it's just kind of been sitting there for a few weeks because I don't feel like going out there and working on it. And I also kind of wanted to focus on my weight loss or rather use it as an excuse to not work in the project car. Got all kinds of, you know, things that I can attribute to it to say, yeah, I should just do that. Like, you know, weight loss is, helps you be healthier even though I'm not going about it in a healthy manner. Nah, it's about the only thing I got going for weight loss. Tell some people my actual diet plans, which I'll probably never actually tell anybody about on this channel. And they're like, that's super unhealthy, you shouldn't do that. And I'm like, that's what they say about being fat. At least every doctor I've ever had has said that. I want to shoot myself in the face with lasers and I get healed, but I roll my massive ball into a wall of lightning and I take damage. What is this game? Thanks for telling me where you are, you idiot. 
actually don't even have reason to blow these up, so I'll just take to 10 health now. Oh, you're hidden away in there like an idiot. Up, up, and away! Double jump. Double the jump or double the fun. Oh, look, an idiot. So why did the doors randomly unlock? Because that dude can definitely see me. That's when he shoots the glasses to try to kill me. Maybe the glasses block me. Apparently they don't take much. Nah, I didn't call him that a hit. I'll drew first blood. Phase on, I guess. Purple lightning. How dangerous. You know, that dude is perfectly safe in here, which is like the worst part about how he died. Oh, not yeah, perfectly safe. I still would have blown that door open with a missile, but. Safer than he would have been if he hadn't blown open the glass. He would have survived like all of 30 seconds longer. It's not much, but when you're going up against Samus motherfucking Iran, you think you'd want to do the best you can. No, I'm sorry, was I supposed to open that portal or am I supposed to walk around and do stuff? No, I'm not supposed to open the portal. How do we get the missile? I want that missile. How do we get that missile? Is that just a way I could have gone? I want that missile, damn it. And these electric things appear to be turned off. Oh yeah, this is just a way I could have gone. I don't think I've ever actually 100 percented Prime 2. I don't intend to now, but I like missiles. Especially since the game seems to not want to give them to me. Poly disengaged. All right, let's go find some idiots and blow them up. Eventually, get a new beam. Yes, you count as idiots, but you're not worth the ammo. Oh, did you get wet behind? Did your bodies leave you to die? Oh, how sad. Alright. Ellie, you. <laughs> Inadvertently shooting at Metroid now. A little too optimistic there, buddy. Pretty sure if I, I, know, I can just shoot these guys out. That's that's unfortunate. I think it's when I come back through here, I get to have fun with them. That's a pretty terrible turret. I can almost outwalk it. Yes, I am going to critique the living hell out of this. Space parts know of my existence. They fear me well enough. They mention me in almost all, not all, but most of their sensitive logs and bedside diaries. The hunter comes and lurks. Oh wow, you can fly! Guess that means I just gotta use missiles. Oh wow, you still don't stand a chance and I don't think you hit me once. That is sad. You give me a jetpack. I'll destroy this planet in a matter of no time. I would need screw attack, double jump, none of it. Where's that thing at that I gotta scan? Ah, oh, that's right, it's all the way over here. Because this is an effective center for things. Yes, thank you for the audio cue, dick. Wow, wow, wow. 
very good with the cinematic storytelling. Yeah, I'll take an energy tank. And then I don't think I can make that jump. Two, and then one. Yeah, that seems right. My god. Why did they have to put all this together here? correct answer is they didn't have to put it together there, but they did anyway. They do. I mean, Sam is living controls like a tank. There's no way they didn't know. None of the, uh, like, five of you that are probably ever going to view this in the lifetime of my YouTube channel. What's your favorite Metroid game? Not being pessimistic in this space and that off of the efforts used from the, uh, Metroid Prime 1 series that I uploaded. Because visually, I think it worked out well. Oh, that's the wrong way. Oop. But I don't think YouTube's really too big on promoting Metroid content for some reason. I don't know, maybe because of the massive arm cannon. Why did the entire tone of the game just shift? Don't ask me. Oh, it's because I was in a puzzle, but now I'm in an unexplored mind area. Holding cell place. Well, if you guys want to know what's on the other side of this door, go ahead, like, comment, and, and or subscribe, and you'll find out next Saturday. All that being said, I do hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Have a good one.